Hey, what's up, guys? I'm back with another update after having uh, the stem cell treatment um, procedure done in South Florida. It has been 15 months uh, since I had the procedure done. And it's funny uh, because last week's video, I was talking about how I was going to get away from doing like visual updates. I still was going to do it, but I said I wanted to focus more on you know research and, and what's what's coming out to help people and what uh, what other people talking about and, and different clinical trials and so on and so on but it's kind of funny that I got a comment and maybe you watching this but it was something to the effect of I did a video and they commented bitch stick to the updates <laughs> I thought that was funny but I'm still gonna do the updates and, and, and anyway whatever but um so, 15 months, um, it's September 2017 as I'm shooting this video, uh, and pretty much, you guessed it if you've been a subscriber, uh, the vision is still the same. Um, if anything, lately, to me, um, still seeing a lot, a lot more uh, floaters, which originally, months ago, I thought it was still stem cells floating around. From the injections but actually they're uh i guess they're floaters and i was told before that really i could either get used to them um maybe they'll go away over time or there's a actual another surgery uh that i could have done and honestly these floaters are very very annoying i know other people get them too but you know I might give it another year or two. Uh, obviously, I got to pay this big ass bill off, but um, maybe down the road I might actually try it. I don't know, just because of the experience that I had with the injections. You know, although uh, doing the eye procedure for getting floater removed, I guess, are somewhat common. So, I guess very minimal risk with anything happening with that. Um, but yeah, overall, it's, it's 15 months later. Haven't really heard from the doctors or the, or the people down South Florida. Um, and like I said before, if you've been watching the video, you can read between the lines that, um, like I said, I just feel like my biggest uh, regret, well, not even really regret, just more like a disappointment with the procedure was the fact that I feel, my personal opinion, that the people down there knew that the percentages uh, success rate wasn't what they what they claim it was. That's my take. Now, I'm sure they, they would say, oh, no, no. But that's just disheartening because, like I say, I wasn't, my vision isn't what it was when I went in there. It's worse, you know, because of the floaters and everything. So it just, it, the procedure didn't help, you know, and... For the first six to nine months after the procedure, really, really four to six months after the procedure, all I kept hearing from the doctors down there and the, the doctor's assistants, whatever it was, oh, give it time, give it time. And, you know, when you call it four months, they would tell you uh, if you're not seeing any progress, they would tell you, well, give it, give it six months. You'll call them back in six months. They'll be like, well, sometimes it take nine months. Then after nine months, you call them be like, what the hell? Then they're like, we well, you know, sometimes we get patients that, that you know, uh, get benefits after a year. Okay, so now we have 15 months, but I haven't as associated with them in probably maybe maybe over three months at this point. And last time I did, they kind of just, they had nothing to say. You know, they had no real answer, especially with the floaters, which was something that, like I said, if the, you're going to spend all that money and you're you're guaranteed uh by people by professionals that you know worst case scenario and this is what i the worst case scenario is you know your vision uh will, will be the same you'll you'll end up the same way you know you came there and that hasn't been the case which is frustrating you know at times a lot of the times it's, it's frustrating but you know it is what it is uh, I'm going to keep going forward and keep, um, you know, looking and, and trying, uh, looking in the new stuff, what's coming out in the future, uh, you know, 
different like vitamins and stuff. A guy that I talked to on Facebook, his name Wayne, uh, we talked back and forth, maybe watching this video. So what up, Wayne? But uh, he uh, has been doing research more than me, but I looked into it and, you know, he's he been doing more than me. Uh, but this like a supplement, dietary supplement called Ida Benone, I think that's how you say it, it's I-D-E-B-E-N-O-N-E. -E -E. Um, if you haven't suffered from any kind of like optic atrophy uh, situation, optic nerve stuff, look into this dietary supplement. It is something that potentially could improve your vision uh, or at least uh, stabilize it where it won't get any worse than what it is. So if you're dealing with any type of optic situations, Look into that uh, supplement, all right? Look into it. Um, and, you know, maybe maybe it's something that you can get into. Uh, eventually, I do want to try that. But, you know, it is, I don't want to call it expensive, but I think it's like 50 bucks a bottle. Uh, and you, you get 50 capsules per bottle. And you're probably going to go through maybe a couple bottles a month, to be honest with you. So, you know... I don't know I, how much I can invest, you know, with that right now, but I will definitely look into it. Um, so that's something that, that's what's going on right now. Um, like I said, same old thing, pushing forward, still doing research. Uh, and maybe, uh, you know, something positive will, will uh, you know, happen from it, but it just, it don't feel that way, to be honest with you. So, um, but once again, like I say in my other videos, if you're going through a eye problem or any sort of, uh, uh, disability or whatever you know you gotta stay positive because we are living in a time in a world where there's every day something new coming out that uh, help your situation treat your situation or even cure your situation i'm trying to stay optimistic and and you know that's all you really can do so that's what i'm doing all right so that's it that's an update there will be other videos coming and uh there might not be just about updates. So whoever said, bitch, uh, stick to the updates. I'm doing other videos too. But still got my You Caring page up, guys. I still owe around $16,000 for this damn procedure and cannot wait to get paid off. So if you want to donate, help get that bill down. I appreciate it. Uh, link in the description of this video uh, so you can check that out. Uh, and if you have any questions or, or feedback, I do read the comments, obviously. So I'll be checking you out. Till the next time. See you.